Pizza well, we've got a tweet here from Robert Foster. <laughs> now, you're going to like this. You're going to what? You're going to be pleased. I've interrupted you, right? Peter Andre's not going to be pleased. He, pleased. he will like I'm it pleased. too. Robert oh. Foster, Piers Morgan. I hope you complimented Susanna Reid for looking so resplendent today. British beauty at its best. Thank you very much, Mr. I Foster. haven't actually complimented you, but you do look resplendent. Thank you very like much. Like a British Please. beauty at its best. Thank you, Piers Morgan. Peter no. Andre. See, I'm here. pleased. I'm pleased that you did that. Thank you, Peter. He's you, right. The last time I Thank saw you. you two together, you were kissing yeah, each other. Yeah, I haven't yes. gotten over it yet. <laughs> <laughs> Did you catch anything? Um, <laughs> yes, we, we shouldn't talk about it. <laughs> no, we shouldn't. <laughs> no. Um, and fun. also, you... Oh, there we there go. You. You've just bumped into the legend that is... Oh, David Foster. Yeah. Do, now, we see, I was talking about what a genius he is. He is a proper genius. Were you tempted it? to sing for him? Absolutely not. <laughs> but what I did do is uh, I spoke to him because I'm going over next month, so we're hopefully oh, going to be meeting. You're going to be nice. in talks. Marvelous. Yeah, well, no, no. I mean, I'd love... He's a dream person to work with. But I'm going out because my film, my first ever film, has been nominated um, in the Beverly Hills Film Festival. Really? The North Hollywood Film Festival. And today, I just got told, the Manhattan Film Festival. I mean, I'm, I'm buzzing. Brilliant. Uh, good for you, mate. Yeah, we said we're going to meet up in America. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. The film but... is Inheritance, The Inheritance. Yes. And he has an epiphany because he's about to sort of end his life and he realises that he shouldn't and life's worth living for and he has this... And it's the story about how he talks himself out of killing himself, so... The Very biggest... The, the biggest... Uh, scandal in America right now concerns this Michael Jackson mm. documentary, oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Leaving Netherland. And you, you, a few quotes from you uh, about this, because you lost out in a dance competition to one of the accusers in the film, Wade Robson, and we're obviously a huge Michael Jackson mm -hmm. fan. You know, I don't know where the truth lies with all this. What do you make of it? As someone who obviously has loved Michael okay. Jackson all your well, life. Well, and almost won this yeah. competition to meet him. He yeah, could have so been I in was Wade there Robson's that day. position. Yeah, I was there that day that Wade won. And I didn't realise until years later that Wade was the kid that, mm. that had won that. The problem is that if you look at the flip side and say it isn't true, mm. this is damaging his family, his mm. brothers, his mother, his kids, mm. his legacy. His legacy's tarnished now because whether it's proven or not, the problem is we don't know 100% mm. what happened mm. and there is some sort of trust you have to have in the justice system. That's my opinion. I think, you know, if it's true, I'd be... Absolutely yeah. devastating. Yeah, it's victims, complicated because you know? nobody really knows yeah. where the truth lies with all this. Um, let's just—we had your ex on. Oh, did you? The other day, and she ended the interview with a rather direct attack at you, oh. which we thought we'd play you and get your reaction. Oh, so here she is. It's only fair. He won't allow me to film with them. He won't allow me to do photo shoots of him, and he's been such a hypocrite. But unfortunately, these days you need both parents' permission. So I just want to put it out there that he's really selfish, and the kids miss out on it. Now, her argument, this is Katie saying that you won't allow the two kids that you have with Katie to appear in her reality show, right, and you're a hypocrite. How do you respond to the allegation? Piers, you should know me by now that I don't talk about these things publicly. I never have. Why would I do that? Well, I only, do to that. be fair, Peter, yes. if someone makes uh, yeah. an, an accusation about you on air, it's only fair that we put that to you it's for okay, your you response. Because we were in the position when Katie said yeah, that... that's OK. ..of not knowing how you would respond. I mean, th th it's a legal issue, so it should never be talked about. Mm. That it should never be talked about, but it doesn't matter. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I should be a politician. Exactly. <laughs> I should be a politician. Yes, you, you should be. Definitely done. done. What, um, what else are you up to at the moment? Starring in Greece. Okay, <laughs> I am. Uh, not as Danny Zuko. Mm. I'm the Teen Angel. Fra is it Frankie Valley or Avalon? Um... Frankie Avalon. Frankie yes. Avalon. Yes, yes. So I should know that. Uh, so I'm going in. I'm just doing a few select ones. Nice. I love doing theatre, but the film is where I'm Well, mate, you're looking great, Shay. Lots doing... going on with you. Good luck Thank with that you, film. Mate. It's obviously very exciting for you. And, and good I'm luck at the with O2 those meetings. tonight. Are you at the O2 tonight? Oh. Good man. You Enjoy. Coming? No. See you there. Right. <laughs> it's a school night. Oh, yeah, that's what it is. It's a school <laughs> night. That's what it is.